Hi everybody, it's me, Jordan Long here, and today I'm going to talk about, you know, feedback. Well, like, where, what does it, where does it actually go? For like, for example, Jordan says, you know, well no, today I'm going to talk about the Google Chrome base, the Google Chrome book, you know, layer of protection and immunity from viruses and worms and Asian Trojan horses and backdoor viruses and malware. Now, people are going to claim that Google are just, are just claiming that. That it's just a bunch of BS and that it's not really immune. You know, that's what they're going to claim. Well, if that's the case, then I don't... <sighs> that's the case. Most computers that run Microsoft Windows or Apple's Macintosh OS, even though they might have some stuff is, are not immune. Now, Jordan said is, here's how I think it's like. But then again, I'm not. But then again, you people can claim that. But then some of the people will claim that it's just propaganda. It's not really immune to stuff or it is. Here's how it's like. Here's a Google Chrome base. Here's a virus. I'm going to infect you. Oh, can't get in. The sandbox won't let me in. Yeah. I get lost. Yes, there is a thing called the sandbox. And the sandbox runs every website and every application that you go on. And if it detects there's a virus or a worm or Asian Trojan horse or a backdoor virus or malware, spyware, whatever, it contains it. It can't come in. Containing is very different from quarantining because quarantining means that you detected it coming in, then you blocked it so it couldn't do any harm, but it still was in. Here's how most traditional antivirus programs operate like. I detect you. <laughs> I'm co- uh, uh, uh. I'm quarantined. Yeah, most traditional antivirus programs work with detecting, quarantining, and deleting the set and fret. Detecting means they detect the virus coming in, quarantine it, and delete it. It's very different from from containing. Containing means that it can't come in. Think of it as a room that has a door, but the door cannot be opened. Think of it like a wall, basically just a wall that it can't get into. Okay? And I know there's a lot of people out there, there's a lot of hackers and virus makers that are really pissed off that Google was able to do uh, one thing that Microsoft and Apple could never do for their computer line. I know. No matter Google, I mean, no matter Microsoft is never going to make a Microsoft Windows that's immune to anything. Just like Apple will never make an Apple's Macintosh OS that's immune to anything. Now people are going to claim, oh, but Google Android is. And yeah, well, Google Android is a different operating system than the Google Chrome OS, you know. And I'm sure that every day there's virus makers thinking, uh, I'm going to make one that doesn't fit any characteristics. And yes, there are some new ones out there. And anyone who has Microsoft Windows or Apple's Mac and Tosh OS or Google Android or even Moldux, you know, uh, Linux, for example, have to be aware of. And that's why there's updates for, you know, Norton Shakir, my, you know, System Tax Norton Security Fleet. I've got them on the Madison my via virus. I'm new. I could mess up Microsoft Windows and Google, and Google Android and Apple's Macintosh show it. Uh, I still can't get into Google Chrome OS. The send bar throwing me in. Fuck you. Yeah, get out of here. 
You know what I mean? So that's all it for me, Jordan Long said. Believe what you want to believe. You know, I'm Jordan Long, and I'll see you later.